Hey guys, welcome back. Today, I'm going to be reacting to the lazy people with genius ideas. Let's go into the video. But first, you gotta subscribe and smash the like button. Now, let's proceed. So, we got a lady cutting onions, but she's too lazy to take a tissue and wipe her eyes. I mean, wearing a welding mask just for a cooking job? Okay. Probably didn't want the oil to get on his face. What's better, <laughs> suffocating in that bag or getting oil on your face? I think oil on your face. Buddy. Still a genius though. At least you don't have to get all that greasy oil on your face and you don't have to smell like oil. Walking oil bag. A Japanese invention, of course. But as you can see, if you look down, those blue and yellow thing flippers are actually pumps that are shoes. So when she walks, you know how she steps? She Each time she pumps, so let's just say she steps on the left one. She pumps air to the head. Let's say she steps on the right. She pumps air to the head from the right. Genius, this is definitely from Japan. Work smart, not hard. Well, I actually do both, guys. Who cares? This is the job, guys. This is the job done, So She's using the spoiler of the car as a desk. But she can still get Wi-Fi. She probably can take her laptop, go on Google, watch some videos, probably mine. So, yeah. <laughs> what? How long is this rope? I'd say like 18 meters. So he can, the guy can just relax instead of pushing the baby. He can just relax in his comfort, drink some Pepsi, take his laptop, watch my videos, then peacefully just swing the baby. I don't know what's better, sitting and doing the job for the baby or the baby sitting and relax. What the heck? First thing I saw was this fan. The heck? This guy just attaches a fan on his back. So in the workspace, you can just never sweat. But what really attracts my eye is that thing over there. What is that tube? Abandoned tube? Probably that was one of his abandoned projects. This is actually the invention of the uh, century. People can just relax instead of having to having to walk those sore legs in the biggest line. So they can just relax, put their shoes away. Oh, what if one of these shoes are the same as the other? They have to, uh, they have to fight for, this, for the spa. They have to fight for the century. Please be aware, chair is broken. The manager of the airport tells one of the, the workers, go fix this chair. This would be good because you're aware, you're telling people to be aware, but I guess people would have more comfort if you just fix it. Do what do you do? Oh, using a, a rusty old heater for your toast. And we don't like, I mean, it might have some extra flavor because of all the dust and the, the bugs that got attracted to light and got burned. Lazy people know the fastest way to do a job, build gates. So basically they're attaching a rope to the lawnmower. Since the lawnmower is pulling this way, it will the rope will pull it, pull it back, causing it to move in a circle. What if you shred your lawn too much? Not for a big fat fail. Ooh, I just got a new chair for my birthday. You know, I don't know how to I don't know how to assemble. I don't wanna I don't wanna call the store and tell them to assemble it for me. You know what? I'll just make a use of the, the box for it. Relax. This is genius. I mean it's easy to, to assemble a chair. Victory! Alright, so we basically have two people. Trying to act as buff man for the photo. I mean, it's for the photo, like, chill, chill. But yet again, it's too squarish. As would kind of be like roundish, ovalish, squarish. Kind of like, a, like that, right? I need this. I need this. Every time I want to eat noodles, I need this fan. In fact, I need it fixed to the bowl. What would I want on the chopstick? What if I have to throw out the chopstick? Goodbye, fan. I can just keep on the bowl. Wait. What if I have to wash the bowl? As far as I can see, that is genius. Next. Whew, I'm too tired to hold my phone. Ooh, my hand sweats. Let's take an elastic band, wrap it around here. Let's put my phone over here, or my walkie talkie. I made the invention of the century. Yay. All I need to do is just call. I'll see you guys. As far as I can see, this is probably like in the old times where Bluetooth wasn't around. So you just peacefully listen to some music while cooking. All right, I guess this guy wanted more of the jam, more of the more of the power, more of the punch, more of the sound. So what can I say? Take my head to two speakers, pump them up to max volume, put them on, turn on the speakers. Buddy, wish you good luck with you. Why did I never think of this? Well, I don't know. So as far as I can see, it's a guy with a Pepsi bottle under him. So whenever I think he breathes, he drinks some Pepsi while he's tanning. All right, pretty cool. That's genius. This lady has a shoe that only two toes poke out. She was too lazy to put nail polish on the other three. So, well, Fantastico had to join in the server and make this shoe. Only have two toes sticking out. These put nail polish on your uh, toes, I think. I'm a boy, so I don't know. But it looks easy, right? Looks easy to the human eye, but is it to the human body? I don't know. Swamp so Thing. What if 
she takes off the shoe. Doomsday. All right, so we have we have a chair with a toilet under. I guess this guy wanted to, uh, yeah, he probably wanted to sit on the toilet for too long, maybe like did the whole day. It's not genius, because I mean, the, what if the plastic pokes your butt? This is marvelous. So you can sit on the toilet whenever you want. Yeah, there's only one downside. What if the, yeah, the plastic pokes your butt? What? <laughs> Mom, I want a cake for my birthday. Can we go get it finally? No, honey. Why? How about we just take the box, add a candle, tape it to the box, light the candle. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Billy. When you can't afford the delivery fee, but you got a car. I mean, yeah. If you have a car, tell somebody, tell your friend to come over, drive it, go to the hardware store, pick up the fridge, drive the fridge to your car, sit on the back of the car, probably the spoiler will break, but I mean, do it for the fridge. Do it for the laziness. You just hold the fridge, better hold it. And then, I mean, fantastico. I guess, uh, I guess this, I see this lady has some problems, but what about the lady in the back? Uh, okay, I mean, she's lazy. Pretty sure that's only for that lady specifically, not you, the person in the back. Or probably, I don't know, maybe she has problems too. I'm not, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna be offensive. So that's a, that's not a comfortable position because the, the lady is pushing her back on the chair, which is making it hurt. And the, there's the other lady standing. I mean, she's only going on her phone, so I, mean, I guess it's okay. Is she even reaching for anything? Oh yeah, she is. She's uh, picking up a, a bag. Ooh, hey George. Yeah? What's up, Bill? Uh, I want you to come over. Alright, what? Why do you have a toilet cap on your head? Oh, like my new style? It's a new trend. The new table. So he's using that thing as a table. This is the best one yet. Well, actually, second best. First best was the Japanese. This is the second best. Marvel. So I'm too lazy to, uh, well, to say walk. So let me take my gaming chair. Let me sit on it. Call my dog. Hey, Spoon. Get over here. No, fuff, fuff, fuff. Oh, you bet. All right, here, put this leash. Now, drive me outside. Yay! Buddy, just please, just walk. You need exercise. You don't want muscle clogs, do you? So yeah, I actually tried this once. It's actually cool. It's really cool, in fact. It's, too, it's not actually laziness. It's kind of lazy, but it's actually, this is actually genius. I have to admire how resourceful this is. Oh my gosh. Using your toilet as a barbecue. I mean, it might have some extra flavor from your from your past your past eatings. I mean, hey, what did I eat for breakfast? Eggs. Oh, I took a poop today. George, what toilet did you use? My barbecue toilet. Yeah, please bring me a bag. Yeah, and I'm not sure about this one. What if the guy still thinks it's uh it's a toilet and then he just sits on it and burns his butt? Now that is a true but burn a new fantastic edition. This guy deserves a problem solver medal. So as you can see, if he's if he's like sleeping like this, he can't really see the TV as well. He flips it on its side, then he sees very well. Awesome! Alright, so this guy taped his phone onto the top of the ceiling. Not that cool. I mean you can just buy a TV and then well yeah. You have a TV, you have a phone. I don't see a difference. Only the TV is like 10 times bigger. Let's proceed. All right, so I think that's the only Cheeto that will get to his mouth. Cause then you'll have to uh, take his handy dandy finger that he's too lazy to do. Then pick up a wonderful Cheeto that weighs like eight milligrams. And oh, it's easy as that. You don't have to be that lazy. Like, I'm not hating. This is kind of genius. Ooh, can I have some uh, some yummy caramel popcorn? But that is actually cool. That's actually that's actually really 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 genius. I want that uh, that drink right now. That reminds me of Pepsi. Hey, Georgie. Yeah. Can you grab me a sweater that's upside down? Why? Right. Never mind. Just have it. Grab me my popcorn. Put it in. Mm. Yummy. Now what if he sleeps? Ooh. Ooh. Using tape as a can holder. So, I mean, I guess this is kind of genius. I mean, what if the bottom falls? I don't know what he used for the bottom to support the can. Probably tape. All right, this guy's putting his head on the wall. I mean, the seat. Probably doesn't want to fall and tumble. Well, if you guys like this video, smash that like button and hit that subscribe button. And I'll see you all next time. Good. Bye. Peace.